We just arrived to the airport and it is 4 a.m. But we are very excited and we're gonna be taking a shuttle over to our check-in area and hopefully get through security without hiccup and then onto the plane. Just wanted to touch base and say good morning. And um, I guess the next time I talk to you face-to-face -face will be when we're in the Bahamas. See you then. Told you we would touch back base when we arrived at Sandals, and here we are. A beautiful afternoon. To get in the water. The water behind us is so blue and turquoise. hotel room at the Sandals Resort. We got everything unpacked and we just kind of getting settled in and we're going to be going to dinner soon. So we just wanted to come on here and say hello and um, thank you for watching this travel video thus far That's right. and enjoying all the pretty uh, flowers and the the foliage that you've probably been seeing because mm -hmm. it's just absolutely beautiful here. It's more beautiful than I could have imagined it being, especially the water. The water. Which we're very excited to get into and splash around in tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow, all day. Yeah, we're looking forward yeah. to it. It's very toasty here. The sun is intense. Mm -hmm. The UV is intense, but um, we're just going to, you know, put our sunblock on and- You will enjoy it. Hope to not get burned, enjoy that water. That's what we want to do, enjoy that water. Okay. So um, we'll just say good night for now and maybe catch up with you another time on our trip. Later. Bye. Hello again from Sandals and good morning. My goodness, did I sleep good last night. 
I mean, I was just out like a light when we finally got back to the room, just so exhausted. The plane flight was good. We had a good little adventure with travel, but an adventure it was. Our second plane flight from Miami to Nassau was actually delayed by a lot but David having good ways about him with this, he was able to rearrange to have us get onto an earlier flight. So we didn't have to wait in the airport as long, but it was still just a very long wait. I think it was about five hours in the Miami airport. So we are very familiar with the Miami airport now. We know all about it. You know, there's just a level of exhaustion that comes with travel. I was so excited to be on the airplane and from Miami to Nassau, I had a window seat, so I was able to look out. And I don't know if you're a little bit freaked out by heights, but I mean, I, I was a little nervous at first just to see out the window at how high up we were. We were flying over the ocean and it was just, breathtaking to see that new perspective and to have such uh, a picturesque aerial view up in the clouds. I just, I loved that experience. It was so fun. Everyone here has just been so kind and welcoming. Um, and I understand that everyone that works here, they're in the hospitality and tourism industry. And with that comes a level of, you know, politeness, courtesy, um, making everyone feel you know, at home, but it's just so genuine. It's just coming across so warm. And that's really making me feel comfortable here in a place that's new to me. Travel is, you know, fairly new to me as well, especially international travel. And I don't have David with me here this morning because he had to go over to a business meeting, not for very long, but I had to venture out and find a little breakfast. I went to canoe. It was just so delicious. The fruit was just perfect, especially the honeydew melon. And I really love papaya too. I don't get to have it very often. So that was just such a treat. Had a little coffee and I'm looking forward to probably going there again tomorrow morning because he has another morning meeting. Now that I'm back here in the room, I just wanted to hop on and say hi and tell you that um, everything's going good and I'm enjoying my traveling. Uh, destination experience thus far and David is as well and it is so good that we were able to get a recovering fulfilling night's sleep that way today we'll have more energy and we won't be lethargic we'll just feel like we can enjoy our surroundings more because of a good night's sleep so my plan now is to grab up our beach stuff and see about heading down to some of the chairs along the oceans um, along the beach see if I can reserve us a spot because I'm sure David will be uh, out of his meeting soon and definitely ready to go enjoy that water that is what he is most looking forward to so um, I will check in with you guys a little bit later and um, thank you for watching and being on this journey with me bye
sunny Bahamas. I wanted to pop on here and check in with you guys again. This is the day that David and I leave and head back home. It's time to depart from this beautiful paradise and get back to our home life, our friends and our family whom we very much miss. It's just been a wonderful little getaway with a lot of R&R. It did us both really good to just have a week to catch up on our sleep to um, eat a bunch of delicious good food, spend some quality time with one another, and it was really great to get to know other members of the company that David works with, get to know them better and meet new faces, talk to lovely people. That was, that was really warming and inspiring. We have a little while before we um, have to check out, so we're just kind of um, soaking up a little extra sun, gonna get a good lunch again before we leave and um, probably not get into the water much but just relax and take it easy until it's time to get on the on the journey again of plane flights and drives home so we just want to take it easy and hopefully everything will go smooth with our travel ahead of us. Thank you all for um, watching and coming along on this adventure with us. I really appreciate it. And if you have any questions about the Sandals Resort and Spa, please leave them in the comments. And um, I just am so thankful that you could come along. And until I see you in the next video, take care and love you all. Bye.